Hey guys, it's Allie. So this week's video, I am testing out um, for the first time nail plates. You basically scrape nail polish on them, use a little bubble thingy, press it, put it on your nails, and it makes a design. Um, I got these from Amazon for $6.99, so they're like inexpensive because I didn't want to pay a lot of money if I wasn't going to like it. Um, and the reviews on these weren't very good, but I got them anyways, and they worked for me once I figured out how to use it. And then same with this. This was like $2 and everyone said it sucked, but it works for me. So I'll put these links in the description and you guys can see me um, attempt to do my nails with this thing. So I'm just going to basically try it out and my nails aren't even like, they're not painted or they, but some of them are painted and some of them aren't. So I'm just going to try a few of them and um, see what it'll look like. I forgot to get like Okay, so I'm just going to be using Ben Nye's liquid latex, which is um, typically for face makeup, because that's what I like to do, is uh, face makeup, but I was like, you know, this will work for this nail thing, and I don't have to buy it, so basically I've never done this before, and this is my first time ever testing it out. Apply the latex. Don't. I've never even watched tutorials on this, I've just seen you know, um, all the popular videos on it, it's like the compilations. So. Yeah. I'm gonna let that dry. And then, um, I'm just gonna like pick a random one. I'm gonna do the. I don't know, I'm gonna try this splatter paint one. That one. I'm pretty sure you just like. Apply some nail polish or something like that. And I don't even know if this nail polish is gonna work because it's like cheap nail polish, but. That again. No, let's do the spider webs because this is my favorite one. Yeah, Okay, so I'm gonna try the spider webs. That kind of work. I got stuck in here. There we go. Okay. So now we're just gonna work. Okay, so I'm the first one because I don't get much. And uh, I'm just gonna okay. okay, so this is what we have for the first attempt. Partially the nail polish. I'm gonna go buy some nail polish. And I'm, so I went to the store and I bought these LA Colors Color Last Nail Color Last nail polishes. They're on sale for uh, 198, so I was like, might as well try them out. And then this is the red in one coat, so I'm honestly like impressed because they were two dollars. So I thought they were gonna need like more than one coat, but so. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a holiday theme because it's almost Christmas and I got another a white LA colors and I'm going to do this snowflake pattern right here and I'm going to see if I can get it to work this time around. Okay. So I'm just going to take the fresh nail polish. Oh, I forgot. I forgot to put on um, a 
the right time. Okay, so that's what I have so far. Um, first attempt. Not too shabby. Okay, so now I'm just going to put liquid latex on the rest of my fingers. That worked really well. Okay. Okay, my only issue is the white it doesn't show up very well because it's probably cheap and polish. It's not probably, it is cheap and polish. So. Okay, so now I'm just gonna do the rest of my nails like this. And then I'm also going to add um, silver with the same thing on the top, just to add some detail. And then I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. Alright, so that's it. Um, I eventually did get my nails, the second hand, this hand, the way I wanted them to. Um, so I wrote down notes so I can tell you what I learned from this experience. And um, the first one is when you're pressing. When you have the nail polish on here and you scraped it, you need to just press like that. Like literally just like, like you don't want to like really slowly, you just want to like press it really fast and really quick. And that, for me, that got the best like result. That's what I'm trying to remember. And then um, you want to choose your colors wisely, like the ones that you're picking up. Because when I put the white on the red, it didn't exactly like, it wasn't fully white, you know. It was like a pink because you can see the red underneath. And then um, the last thing is practice makes perfect. I did my presses probably over 20 times before I got it right. But it's worth it, it's really cool, and um, I think I'm gonna have a lot of fun with it. So I totally recommend those two items for like starting out um, like me. And yeah, so that's it for this week's video. Don't forget to leave suggestions in the comments. Like, comment, like, blah, blah, blah. Don't forget to leave suggestions in the comments and like this video and subscribe and I'll see you next week. Bye.